I've lived here for almost seven years. Well, we began to think perhaps our house was rather large and we ought to downsize. Maintenance at my house was sort of building up a little bit and I felt it was too much for me. The real trigger for the move was, uh, you know, we had a two-storey house and uh, Sue was experiencing increasing problems going up and down stairs. We thought rather than wait for an accident to happen, it was perhaps the time to, to make the move. One thing we like to travel, and we're safe here, we can lock this up and go. We were in America last year, we're in Australia this year. So we have the best of all worlds. It was a case of um, taking the pressure off you. When you've got your own home, you know, you've got a lot of pressure on, making sure everything's done the right way. This felt safe to start with. A different way of life, which is thrilling in a way, at our ages coming in. We couldn't have done it without Audley's support. Now we've all been feeling the same things all the way through from when you view and you think, well, shall we? Because it's a huge decision to make. But we also felt we were doing it at the, for us, the right time. Friends and other people have said, don't leave these changes, these moves, too late. We wanted to do this together whilst we were able. We did our maths and we worked it all out because we thought, oh goodness, it'll be expensive to live there. But when we listed everything, we realised that actually it was very good. And the lovely thing is if my children come, they can actually stay here. They love the swimming pool, that's a great attraction. I use the gym a lot. I think the gym is fantastic. My wife and I use the hairdresser. And we have so many other things going on, like um, a book club, a poetry club, um, a bridge club. They had a casino night, which was good fun. We all dressed up. And the food here is lovely. Look at this lovely dining room. One of my favorite meals is brunch. And it's lovely, as you say, with the birds singing and the view and the sun shining. It's, it's absolutely lovely. It's a very sociable village and people are very kind and supportive. And I think that's the wonderful thing. If you live here, you need never be lonely. When we first came here, we knew it was the care department and we were introduced to the care manager and so on. We, we thought, oh, well, that's, that's great. But we never thought we would be using the care department so relatively quickly. My wife uh, suffered a stroke. She was in hospital for four and a half months and that's when I got involved with the care department who has been fantastic. I mean, they really uh, do a tremendous job. Well, living at Ellerslie takes away all the worries. It's a new chapter. New chapter, yeah, <laughs> it is. I just believe that, uh, you know, living here is like living in a five-star hotel. 